Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. So in this video, I am going to tell you about Windows Credential Manager. So over here in Windows, to access any credential uh, securely, we have got a Credential Manager in which we can store our email, passwords, or any kind of secure data under a generic credential. So like over here, go over here, there's a network address, which is just a key. You can give any name over here. Like suppose I am giving mail credential the username which you want to access like for example my email id and the password of your account so for this video i have created another credential called mail credential and over here i have this network address mail credentials my email my password which is safe and cannot see any anyone other than me no one can access this now what i can do to access an ui part you go to manage packages all packages and search for ui path dot credential activities now install this one save through these activities we would be able to access those credentials and use them in our bot now uh, for example i call get credential activity this get secure credential now in the target it will come the address key that we had written like the mail credentials I will create a password, a username, and suppose I want to send a mail using this. So let's say send SMTP mail message into, I will write my email, any kind of subject can place over here, any body, the Port number for SMTP is 587 and server address is smtp.gmail.com. Now email, I will just write its username and secure password. I don't know, sometimes does not work. So I will go with password. Over here, we have to add an expression to convert that password system secure string to string. New um, system.net.net for credential string dot empty comma here comes our password variable now this is the function password okay let's confirm our password is correct now if i just click on debug it will send a mail by accessing the credentials from my windows credential manager and hence the mail is sent for more such videos do like and subscribe to my channel thank you keep on learning